James Kemp and Lieutenant, U.S. Navy. It wasn't like a World War II tin can. And I really wish some of those would be preserved so people could see them. The pictures I see, the stories I hear, I had nothing like their experience. Um, there was some air conditioning. There were, the racks were you know, tight, but not bad. Um, it was OK. Food was decent. Not like I got on the carrier, but it was decent. Um, it was nice. In, in many ways, the, the destroyer, the, the junior officer on his destroyer, so far as living conditions, um, birthing conditions, was better than on the carrier. In the carrier, they had an area that was, it was kind of like nobody really wanted to take good care of it. The, the, there'd be, you know, water slopping around the, the floor. And, and, and uh, I remember getting a real laugh on the, when I, I, I saw, I'd like towel off and I'd drop the towel and then some, what I just I didn't even bother to pick it up and toss it to the garbage. <laughs> like, I can't touch this thing again. Um, but in many ways, the, uh, the destroyer was, was better maintained for a junior officer area than, than the carrier was. Well, meals were taken in the, in the wardroom. Um, wardroom was a, not a big room, but it, it was with it a ship. Um, it served as a, as a battle dressing station in, in the case of uh, general quarters. Um, there was a table, uh, a big table with a bench seating around it. I think some chairs as well. Um, there were stewards that, well, I don't think, I think the, the rate steward went away by that time. Um, but the, they called them mess cook, the mess specialists that had the, um, they'd have people from, the junior people from each division would be part of the, they called them mess cooks. And, uh, and there was some assigned to the wardroom and they'd take care of us there. Um, we'd have food brought out you know, the, the meal to eat. Um, we would, uh, one, each day, each meal, one officer would, use, typically a junior officer, would be assigned to go um, eat in the cruise mess just because you sample the food they're getting. And if there was some, anything, you know, if it wasn't good, like you were supposed to do something about it, at least to let people know. Um, um, the food was very similar. Uh, it was... The cruise mess was more like a big cafeteria, where the the wardroom was more like a dining room. But like, like, yeah, leave it at that. It was a big cafeteria versus dining room. We had decent mattresses, like they were like actually there was some mattress there, um, and the beds were wide enough, and long enough. Uh, it was actually much more spacious than the enlisted racks. Strangely, I, I didn't hear people complaining about the enlisted racks. Maybe they didn't, know, they didn't feel there was any point in complaining about it, but, um, but the, the officer racks, the, even the junior officer uh, bunks, were, were more spacious. They were comfortable. Um, they, were, they were stacked still, uh, but at least two. And in one, one birthing area, a J.O. birthing area, there were, there were three high. Um, but it was, they, they were fine. 